Hi, it's Sarah here from Crafting and Stamping and I'm back with another quick tip. My tip today is about creating two card fronts, two quick card fronts at the same time. So I'm going to be using a sneak peek of some of our new celebration papers that are coming on the 3rd of August. So we've got some papers that actually go really well with the hand penned DSP. The hand pen DSP you can actually get on uh, offer 15% off up until the 2nd of August. So you might want to stock up on that, ready to get hold of this next one. So we've got this these patterns on one side and then a white with black pattern on the other. And what I'm going to be using at the moment is this one, which matches this paper and you don't need to do this if you've not got matching papers but what I'm doing is making sure that my pattern is matched up exactly so that's going to be exactly the right way around for my paper so I'm going to get those aligned completely lift that up and I want to cut these at three and seven yeah three and seven eighths just trying to remember then so and again I'm just making sure that that is fully lined up we've got an, a nice alignment of them there so at three and seven eighths I'll cut three and flip that around keeping it aligned really important to keep it aligned you could even wash your tape it together temporarily while you cut so that gives me two identical card fronts one purple and one black and they're the same pattern now again I'm going to get these lined up like that and then I'm going to do this and I'm just doing it by eye I'm not getting um, the ruler out to check measurements or anything but I'm going to get it lined up so that it's a little over an inch, maybe an inch and a quarter down from one end and a similar amount from the other. It doesn't have to be exact. And cut through and then we've got hard fronts that we can mix and match. So those are our card fronts, but what we can do is pop those two together and they line up beautifully and we can put those two together and again they line up beautifully and that's exactly what I've done for these two cards here. I'm going to very just quickly show you that you can do this again with different patterns of paper they don't have to be matching ones like we've just used here so again this is a tiny sneak peek another celebration goodie that we'll have got these wonderful little penguins and i've used the same paper but i've flipped it over so that they're facing different directions and i'm going to do exactly the same as i just did and get this lined up so that it's roughly let's get that about about right one two one and a quarter inches at either side pull through and then what we've got we can mix and match these um, or if you don't like the fact that his head's been cut off this polar bear here you might have got something going over the center there anyway but you can always flip that over and pop it on from that side so that's how to get two quick card fronts at the same time so you've got two cards on the go uh, saving you a lot of time hope that helps if you enjoy these quick tips please subscribe to my channel and I'll be back with a quick card on Monday. So quick cards on Mondays and quick tips on Fridays. Thanks for stopping by.